everybody. It's Black Friday. And if you're not out shopping, you're probably doing your shopping online. And you're going to be glad that you're tuned into Tech of Tomorrow because today on Black Friday, we're only bringing you guys some news. We're bringing y'all some deals. That's right. Some steel deals and all of them will be online. You don't even have to go and wait in the line. So that said, though, we also have two really cool news stories for you guys. Now, last week, PlayStation came out. All kinds of cool stuff. And you guys all know Twitch and how they stream all this stuff. Well, this one couple decided that they were going to get drunk, show themselves in front of the camera. And, you know, that was going pretty good for a while. But then as the night progressed and they got drunker, this guy started stripping his wife naked on Twitch for everybody to see. That's right. Now, my big question is, though, how many of you guys out there, and don't be liars, how many of you guys were tossing off when this guy was stripping his wife naked? Come on, don't lie to Elric. You guys all know some of you were. I know for a fact there's somebody out there watching right now who's watching that video going, <laughs> but hey, hold on to the thing. But the bad news about that is because they did this, now that kind of stuff has been banned. So now Twitch is not even allowed to be on the PlayStation Network right now. So these people doing this, has actually screwed the entire world over. So now, right now as it is, you can't even use this service. Now, hopefully they'll just make some kind of change to the end user agreement so that you will be able to do this. But that's just crazy, crazy stuff. This guy strips his wife naked when she's drunk in front of the camera. Now, she either woke up and she was like, oh, honey, you big idiot. Or she was like, I'm gonna kill you, mother depending on how our personality is. So that's it. That's the first story. For more information, check out the link down there in the description. We'll have the full story in this if you guys want to get more, even more details about this story. Now, the next story up. Intel, getting ready to debut in 2015, Knight's Landing. Now, when I first heard Knight's Landing, I'm thinking to myself, is this a new David Hasselhoff show? Like, you know, starring David Hasselhoff, Knight's Landing. You know, just kind of revisiting his Knight Rider theme, but his, you know, Knight's Landing. It's kind of like a mixture of like one of those soap opera shows, you know, where everybody's all sad, you know, like the landing thing and then the Knight's Landing. Or I got an even better theme, Knight's Landing. It's a science fiction program about knights from outer space who land on Earth and then take over. No, that's not what it's about at all. It's actually Intel's latest Xeon Phi computing. And this thing's going to be incredible. Now, one of the big things that Intel wants everybody to know right off the bat is that with this new generation of Xeons, you're no longer going to have to have an actual CPU and a cartridge to make it work. Currently, right now, what's going on is you have a cartridge slot that goes in and that works with the CPU. Now, the cartridge is completely gone and this is gonna be its own complete standalone CPU package. And it has all kinds of features. Now, Knight's Landing is a CPU that will have 16 gigabytes of DRAM, 3D stacked on package that will provide up to 500 gigabytes a second of memory bandwidth, along with up to 384 gigabytes of DDR4 2400 mainboard memory. When Intel makes the move to the 14 nanometer process, then Knight's Landing will make its debut and things should happen sometime in 2015. With the promise of such power that Knight's Landing will bring to the table and its three teraflops of double precision per socket, we will most assuredly see 100 plus petaflop x86 computers being produced very soon. I'm sure companies out there like Aberdeen LLC who brought us the first petabyte computer will jump into this market very soon. You guys are going to see supercomputing take on a whole new level. Now, right now, the only competition that Intel has is from NVIDIA. That's right. They're the only ones right now that are giving competition. And this is kind of competing right into head to head with those. So if you guys want to see a lot more information about this, because this is like a pretty gnarly subject and I want to kind of just jump on it and show you guys the deals, check out the link in the description below where you guys can see all the information about this new night's landing if you guys are into like hardcore technology and just you know seeing the super crazy computers you guys want to check this story out and what's going on with it now with that said like we said it's black friday and we've got a whole lot of deals for you guys to check out so that said let's jump in and let's start showing you these deals for black friday all right folks so we have tons of gaming deals right off the bat incredible stuff Battlefield 4, $29.99. Who beat that sucker. Also, Far Cry 3, $7.49. 
We've got the entire Metro franchise pack, including Last Light for $14.99. Batman Arkham Origins for $19.99. Borderlands 2 and Borderlands 1 Game of the Year Edition for $11.99. And then, last but not least, Max Payne 3 and GTA 4 for $7.99. Now, those are some incredible gaming deals. They're ultra cheap, and those are all really fun-ass games that you will like playing. Next up, more Black Friday deals. All right, folks, for you guys out there who own PlayStation, PlayStation Plus for $29.99. Now, that's a really good deal. And for those people who like being online and like playing stuff and like using it, this is something you folks are going to be interested in. And I know lots of people out there have bought the brand new, the brand new PlayStation 4, so you guys are really going to want to jump in on this. Now, I know a lot of you people out there are always looking for killer storage, and SSD storage is a bit pricey usually. You know, these things, like, you know, 240 gigabyte level have been as far as 300 and something dollars, but now you can get the crucial M500 960 gigabyte super fast SSD $439. Yeah, that's right. The sky is... I'm looking for the sky to fall. That is actually an incredible price. When I saw it, the first thing I did when I looked at it was like... I wish I had $439 right now. Honestly, this is a deal that me personally, I would jump on immediately. 960 gigabytes of SSD storage. Man, I could store all my games, all my cool stuff, all my, you know, all on that drive. $439. To me, this is actually one of the coolest Black Friday deals and one that I regret that I can't buy because I want it. Next up, we have the Klipsch. S4i-2 in-ear headphones for $39.99. Now check this out. I know a lot of you people out there have been really looking for these 4K TVs that have been coming out. This company called Psyche, they've had theirs out for a little while. You can now get the 39 inch for under $500. And this company makes pretty good stuff. I believe in it enough that I actually bought a TV from these guys for my mom. They had a 46 inch TV, 300 bucks. Merry Christmas, Mom. I hope you're liking it, by the way. That's an incredible deal. So if you're looking for a 4K TV, you can get this one for under 500 bucks. 39 inches, all kinds of killer stuff. And you can look at the ratings. It's actually rated quite well. I know they're a new company and people aren't familiar with them. But hey, the ratings are good. Amazon doesn't seem to lie about their ratings. They seem pretty good. So we'll see. If my mom complains, I'll let you know. Next up, we have a 240 gigabyte Intel 530 SSD for $155. We also have the Logitech G700 gaming mouse for $49.99. The BenQ GW2255 21.5 inch gaming monitor for $125. And last up, one more storage item. Now, this is the Seagate two terabyte hybrid drive. Now, I don't know if you guys know much about the hybrid drive, but the hybrid drive uses an SSD and your drive mixed together so that it runs very, very fast. Kind of like Intel's technology, but it's their own. Now, this thing's coming to market at $99. That's a very good price for this drive. Hmm, another one of those items I wouldn't mind having. All right, folks, so that's it. Two top stories on Friday and all kinds of killer deals for you folks to do. You don't have to get up and wait in the line or anything else. You can just sit there and click and choose. How much easier can it be, my man? I'm serious. Now, check it out. I know you guys all want a chance to win that $100 Amazon gift card. All you got to do is head over to the Black Friday article and leave a comment saying what was your favorite deal that you guys saw today. Then we're going to pick a winner and somebody's going to get that $100 free Amazon gift card and you can buy that and it's worldwide. You guys are always asking stuff worldwide. Yes, this is worldwide. Also, pay attention on Sunday. On Sunday, we're going to be bringing you guys a video talking about the brand new Christmas Isthmus holiday season giveaway. Starting next week, we are going to be giving gifts away all the way until Christmas Day. So you guys are going to want to stay tuned and check that out. I'm Elric. This is Buddy the Dog. Thanks for watching. Hope you guys got what you guys wanted on Black Friday. I got some cool stuff, but like the rest of you guys, just click my mouse. I guess I'll go back to cooking.